Let's go for a little walk. It's a place called the Riverwalk, Mishawaka Riverwalk. It's real pretty out here. Whenever I come out here, I always feel like I want to run because this is where we used to run all our 5Ks and do all our jogging. This park has always had a problem with Canadian geese. We get hundreds of them here. They can get kind of mean too. Them geese can get mean. Don't walk near them. Shit all over the park. Just checking my shoes for goose poop. Okay, I think I'm alright. It's real pretty here. See these? Each one of those apartments go for about $350,000 in a little city called Mishawaka. What is that? Egg? This is why we can't have nice things. This is the St. Joe River. It's pretty, but I wouldn't want to swim in it. It's pretty dirty. Nice day. And they're building more luxury riverfront. What used to be on this site was Uniroyal. We called it Ball Band. It's where my grandfather retired from. It was a big, huge rubber factory. This is Mishawaka. That little white building there. That's where my mom went to beauty college, Vogue Beauty College. That was a nice walk. It was a nice day. We're now at the Hundred Center. The Hundred Center used to be a brewery years and years and years ago but now it's all nightclubs bars and restaurants they still have some of the old brewery equipment standing around some of it's just closed down now Like I said, now they have some bars and some restaurants in here. When I was a teenager, after we go to football games, we would go to a place called the Rathskeller. It would say right here, Rathskeller. And you walk down here, down into that doorway, and uh, you'd be like underneath the tunnel, and it would turn into a pizza place. And it was really cool. This was the Cam and Schellinger Brewery. In 1951, it all stopped. I used to be a biker. <laughs> 